Yes sir, yes sir, what is up everybody? It's uh, yours truly, the Trigger Trigger here. Playing some more of that Metal Gear Solid Twin Snakes. This is part nine of my walkthrough. So, uh, new viewer, welcome in. Returning viewers, welcome back. Sit back, relax, enjoy the show. Let's do this. Okay, so we just clapped a sniper wolf. Let me get that tag. Uh, I kind of feel bad for her, but uh, she was talking a lot of shit. Let's give her the old tea bag. Uh, let's do some uh, item collecting. Take that out. Where you at? Right there. Not ready to go down there just yet. Huh. Level 7. Level 6. Let me uh, equip the mine detector. I remember when I was playing MGS1, uh, I was getting blown to shri- Holy crap, yeah. Yeah, I was getting blown the fuck up. Ration. I don't even know if this game has a uh, level 7 cord. MGS1. Our next fight will be uh, Vulcan Raven. Let's take these out. Got some chaff. Got some more chaff. Are those lockers? No. Let's try the other side. I remember MGS1 was like a hidden cutscene. Or, uh, not a cutscene, uh, a code that called you can find like the liquid's parachute hanging on the fence. Let's. Shit. Go up. There we go. Take that bandage. Let's just use one so we can uh, collect one. There we go. Take you out. There we go. Nikita. Got that box three. Let's see if we can find that, uh... That parachute. If not, I'm gonna uh, continue going. They might have took out the uh, twin snakes. Yeah, it's like they took it out of the game. I wonder what's behind that level 7 door. Let's not shoot the wolf puppy. Yeah, if you want to check out my MGS1 walkthrough, you'll see what I'm talking about. Blast Furnace. Just in case there's enemies, let's switch to the old... Non-lethal. Oh, there's one right there. Let's put him nighty night. Looks like he's the only... Oh, there's... 
Get that. I'll never forget how many times I busted my ass on this thing in MGS1. Hold up, hold up, hold up. There's someone down there I think I saw. Split him out. Let's split him out. I just suck. Go to sleep. I think I hit him. Okay, now he's going to sleep. Hmm, let's try something. Since now I can do this. I was afraid that was going to happen. Ugh, let's get these out of here. There we go. No, I didn't want to equip that. Okay. If I remember correctly, it's this way. Yep. Nikita. Oh, shit. Didn't think I was going to get hit by that. Oh, I definitely remember that from the first one. Uh, uh, the ration was tucked in like a little corner. I kept falling and dying. I'm just gonna get more cargo elevator. Uh, let me equip my mind detector because, yeah, MGS1 had me pissed. I kept getting blown to shit. I'll take that. Nothing over here. What we got up here? That PGS1. Now I gotta hit the other side up. Nothing there. Socom bullets, perfect. If I remember correctly, I'm gonna need my FAMAS. Yep, good thing I equipped it. But uh, I'll serve these fools up real quick. So I can run and gun, okay. Reload the damn gun. There we go. There we go. Sorry for sucking just now. I was, I was actually debating if I can do the run and gun thing, because uh, that came in handy MGS1. Okay, I should be good on uh, enemies here, so let's just go with SOCOM. Let me get Mind Detector. Let's take you out. Let's get you.
see if there's anything on this side. M9 bullet. Why is there any mines? I, re I remember getting blown the hill walking through here. Okay, I didn't do this in MGS1, but we're going to do it here. Fuck those crews. Uh-oh. Snake, I've got something to tell you about. Oh, I was in trouble. What about her? Is this conversation secure? Don't worry. The monitor's off. Okay. What's up? I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background, about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. No. What did you say? It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied? She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on. Even a high school student could see past it. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? Yeah. At the time when Edgar Hoover was head of the FBI, there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 50s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But you better check it out. The chief and the president mysteriously dying. That ninja. Too many strange things are happening. Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? If I find out anything, I'll call. In the meantime, be careful. Oh, I'm getting attacked by the crews. Okay. Those uh, crows won't attack me. That was the wrong grenade. Got something for one of you motherfuckers. Take that. What do you want? Snake. Killing all those <laughs> help anything, you know. They're just birds. What makes you hate them so much? You know, speaking of the codec, let's uh Okay, I don't see uh Naomi. Y'all better leave me alone. Okay, I don't see any, uh... Mines, so I guess I'll need the mine detector. This C4 is gonna come in handy. I'll take that ration. Okay, let's head on in. There he is. Welcome, Cossack. Uh oh. friends they're becoming excited in a good way or a bad way how dare you kill my friends man fuck your friends <laughs> aren't scavengers like most people think they're simply returning to the natural world that which is no longer needed sometimes they even attack wounded foxes you were the one in the M1 tank. 
Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> but that was no true battle. <laughs> Ravens and I were testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The Ravens say you are a true warrior. Am I hallucinating? I... I can't move. Raven has put the mark of death upon you. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Ah, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. I wonder how he knows this. Inuit he must be a telepath. Our cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. There's no crows in my family tree. You ready? I am not fond of snakes, but you are family, so I cannot complain. But there will be no holding back. in Alaska too. You know of the world Eskimo Indian Olympics. With that strength, you must have been training in the stick pull and four-man carry. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the ear pull. It's an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. At least it ain't the dick pull. Each other's ears. The form is different, but the spirit is the same. Rejoice, Snake. Ours will be a glorious battle. This isn't glorious. It's just plain killing. Violence isn't a sport. Well, we will see if there is iron in your words. Damn, that dude is strong. Mm-hmm, yeah. Just pulled the rocket launcher out of my ass. That's a long ass missile. Okay, well, let's equip some rations. Let's get a stinger. Take that. Why am I running around with a porno mag? Uh oh. Let's get the stinger. Okay, he's way over there. Get 
More stinger. I don't know how that missed. Oh shit. Uh, I'm bleeding. Hey, buddy. Got his ass. There you go. I think he's running. There he is. Let's get some uh, clay more. He's getting close. Get my uh stinger. Take it. Got his ass. Get that stinger. Take that shit. Even kind of hard there, aren't you? Come on, Reven. Come on, come on, big boy. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Got a heal. Where's he at? Come on, buddy. I see you hit the claymore. That's not gonna work. Oh, shit. No, you don't. Get him, get him, get him. This is definitely more annoying than the last time. I got an idea. Let's put some claymores down. Use this to track him. Whoa, he's chasing me. Get a stinger. Come on, Raven. Get 
Yeah, this is definitely more frustrating than the last time I played this. I just rocket launcher the crow. You know what? Take that bitch. We'll do that. <laughs> Sorry for that sucky boss fight. But a win is a win. Just as the boss said, it is my existence which is no longer needed in this world. But my body will not remain in this place. My spirit and my flesh will become one with the ravens. In that way, I will return to Mother Earth who bore me. Snake! I will be watching you. Understand? Snake, take this security card. It will open that door. Why? You are a snake, which was not created by nature. You and the boss, you are from another world. A world that I do not wish to know. Go and do battle with him. I will be watching from above. First, I'll give you a hint. The man you saw die before your eyes. That was not the DARPA chief. It was Decoy Octopus, a member of Foxhound. He was a master of disguise. He copied his subjects down to the blood. So he drained the chief's blood and took it into himself. I still want to know what kind of boss fight De Decoy Octopus would have been. Like, death. the only boss you fight without actually having to kill him. Why go to so much trouble? Why impersonate the chief? <laughs> that is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. It's gonna be a painful way to die. Snake, in the natural world, there is no such thing as boundless slaughter. There is always an end to it, but you are different. What are you trying to say? The path you walk on has no end. No matter how far you go, or how many corpses you crawl over, the killing will never end. It's a future without hope. Hear me, Snake! My spirit will be watching you.
Snake, it's me. Master? It's about Naomi. Turn your monitor off. What about Naomi? Damn. Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Really a nap? What is this about Naomi? Okay, maybe we'd better let the Colonel hear this too. Yeah, go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And? There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there was one. But she's not the woman we know. The real Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So then who is she really? She must be some kind of spy. A spy? Yes. Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So, you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. A different group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest, Colonel. What? She's betrayed us, Colonel. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Colonel, have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? He did. Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. You're lying, buddy. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait. Wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. Hurry, then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. Snake, give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. Okay. Let's head back over here. I'll take that. And let's give a good old savoru. Naomi wasn't acting strangely or anything. No. I, I just can't believe that Naomi's an enemy spy. I refuse to accept that. Uh, I don't want to believe it either, but. Don't say it, Snake. Save. Override. Alrighty, this is the Trigger Trey here. I'm going to go ahead and end the video. Thanks for watching. This completes uh, part 9 of my uh, Twin Snakes walkthrough. Only one video left in the series, and uh, the last one's going to be a long one, just for a uh, heads up. Uh, if you're watching, please do me a favor. Thumbs up, comment, share, subscribe, and uh, be seeing you in the future on some more epic gaming adventures. Peace.